I won't say that it's the reason is because we want to practice chasing. It's, I mean, when you play Australia, you play to to win a game of cricket. It's um, it's you know it's it's, a, it's always a very competitive game of cricket when you play against Australia. So for us, it's it's all about winning a game of cricket. So to me, I felt as the we had our best chance today bowling first. I thought it was going to be a bit more moisture moisture in the in the first ten overs. So. If I look back now, I probably would have batted first, but <laughs> um, I'm, I'm still very happy with the victory. It was a great choice, um, a great team effort. I think there is a slight advantage, but having said that, we had enough runs to defend. So, um, you know, if you bat well, you can still get a, a good target, um, a good total. So, I, I don't think I don't think we can be using that as a as a reason or an excuse. We were all quite surprised with that. Um, look at, well, on the other hand, um, looking at the first team that played against Zimbabwe, we thought. Bowling first um, on a on a wicket that might have a bit of moisture in. They only play six batters. We can run through them as well. So it's a, that's probably the way they looked at it. They wanted to make sure they have enough batting. Uh, I'm pretty sure looking back now they would have probably played um, Nathan. But um, look, you, they still had an amazing cr cricket team that played today, and we were just a better team today. Yeah, possibly. I mean, it, we 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 tried taking the pace off the ball a little bit, and it didn't seem to have too much too much effect at different times so I think there's no doubt that variation is going to be a key and that's just being able to mix up your pace and lengths and, um, and you know how you bowl at different stages but um, you know I've got to give a little bit of credit to, to Faf and AB I, did, I thought they batted beautifully. I'm extremely proud and very happy for him um, he's, he's been under a lot of pressure from a lot of people in the ODI format so for him to score that 100 today we've always had a lot of um, belief in him as a player and he's, he's definitely our rock there, has been for the last while. Um, he's playing unbelievable cricket at the moment and I'm really, really very happy for him. Um, he just proved a lot of people wrong. Um, but I know, I know that's not the reason why he plays the game, but um, he's just in great form and hopefully he can maintain that moving forward. I think it's just really comfortable, you know, we've played a lot of cricket together. Um, we understand each other's games really well. Um, so at times where AB feels you know, he knows what's going through my mind and he speaks to me about it and then I take it on board and the same with him, you know. I know I can see when he's probably looking to score runs that it's not needed or something like that and we talk to each other and uh, there's a huge amount of respect for that relationship so we understand that. Um, but it's great, it's great to be, you know, growing up together, batting from school cricket um, and, and playing for your country, bat batting against Australia. Uh, like Avi said, I don't play... Um, this beautiful game to answer critics um, but uh, when you're chasing 330 you have to up it a little bit um, obviously my role would still be to be there but I mean I, can't, I have to go at more than running a ball so when when I feel that the wicket is good and I can score in the areas that I feel is not as high risk um, I'll definitely try it but uh, there was be a few times that AB said to me just calm down a little bit um, and I had to wind myself a little bit back. It was a good cricket wicket let, let me say it like that so I think after uh, Australia laid a foundation, we were always going to be under a little bit of pressure. They were always going to target a few guys. We've got great depth in our bowling, and I've, I've got a lot of faith in us moving forward as a bowling unit. So I'm not too worried. Vernon also comes back. Um, he gives us that option as an all-rounder as well. So there's good depth and, and a good balance in that team. I'm very happy where we're at.